Hello all, uh, welcome back to my channel. In our previous uh, video, we discussed on constructors and destructors. So in this video, uh, we will try to explore the same with a simple example. So let's create a class, say class Z. And uh, yeah, let's uh, create a constructor here. So default constructor maybe. Yes, and we will just print out uh, here as uh, constructor is called so that we get to know when uh, it's called. So constructor is called. Okay, maybe okay so similarly we will add a destructor yes so constructor is called destructor is called so we have a class and we have created a, a constructor here and a destructor here so uh, we will create a uh, you know object of this class now so we already know that whenever an object is created, the the constructor is called. So and uh, yeah, let's uh, try to run this. Let's save this and let's run this. So yes, dot cpp. Yes, now executable is created. Enter and if you see, constructor is called. So as soon as this object is created, right? Uh, the constructor is called and then at the end of the program the destructor is called now uh, okay say for example you have other uh, some other objects or le let me okay let me add a variable here uh, maybe one and so if uh, a equals equals one I mean to say I just wanted to give a condition so I gave this simple condition and we just create another object of the same class so and then let's see how this uh, you know uh, constructor and destructor is uh, called so so as per this see as, as the value of a is one the condition is true so uh, firstly the constructor is called this line will be executed twice and at the end uh, the destructor is called will be executed twice so that is how it should be so let me just save this and let me create a executable and let me run that and now if you see constructor is called constructor is called so for two objects and then destructor is called twice so this was regarding constructor and uh, destructor with a simple snippet thanks for watching the video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up thank you